Rhode Island Attorney General's office is cracking down on crimes against children by creating a new unit dedicated solely to investigating and prosecuting cases of child abuse. Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Estefan is in the newsroom now with details that are new at 5. We've learned every year a thousand Rhode Island children are treated for some form of abuse. Now those children have a new unit fighting for them. The victims often can't speak for themselves. A voice that will grow stronger with the new child abuse unit at the Attorney General's office, a partnership forged with Day One DCYF and police. Amy Goldberg treats children of abuse. She says the new unit will help the process move swiftly. They need to be responded to when they're crying out for help. Speed and support, two key elements to the treatment of abuse victims. How can a child speak the appalling, the unimaginable, the horrible, the inexpressible, without someone giving them a voice. DCYF tells us nationwide one in four girls and one in six boys will fall victim to sexual abuse before their 18th birthday, a rate that has seen improvement, but there is a growing number of less severe cases. Rates of child sexual abuse have decreased overall. Um, the cases of child physical abuse nationally have increased, actually. Goldberg tells us that trend makes it a critical time for the new unit, ensuring the tough work, tough conversations had here will help an already uphill battle. The abuse of a child, be it sexual or psychological or in any form, frankly is one of the toughest crimes uh, not only to detect, but to prosecute. A day of hope for abused children across the state. This is day one for the children of Rhode Island, and it is a good day. The new unit will include two experienced prosecutors as well as a victim services representative. In the newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.